So we'll start with plant one, big fossil. And we're going to use the same plant we used in our earlier example. Uh, that was a 500 megawatt capacity power plant. Uh, had an overnight cost of $320 million. And so at 7% interest, 360 month contract, that's a fixed monthly payment of $2,129,000 per month. The heat rate is assumed to be 9 million BTU per megawatt hour. I'm making these numbers up, so I'm not saying this exact is exactly like any power plant you know, uh, but we're assuming a heat rate of 9 million BTU per megawatt hour for all of our fossil, uh, for our fossil power plant, and a preferred capacity factor of 80%. Could be 70%, could be uh, 85%, but in this case we're assuming uh, capacity factor of uh, 80% for our power plant. Uh, the marginal cost is the fuel cost per megawatt hour and that's $22.50. We just take our um, uh, fuel cost and our heat rate and we get $22.50 per megawatt hour. Uh, each 1% of capacity of this power plant will generate 3,600 megawatt hours of electricity. So this is a big baseload power plant and each 1% capacity will generate quite a lot of electricity. The long run average cost, the long run uh, average cost of the power plant is the levelized cost of energy from this power plant and that is 2990. So that is the average cost, the average total cost of the power plant at the anticipated capacity factor for the power plant. I'll show you that in a picture in just a second, but the, the important point to make is the levelized cost of energy is the long run average cost at the capacity factor we expect to have for this power plant, so the average capacity factor over its lifetime. So let's take a look at uh, the average and, and variable cost for this power plant. Big Fossil has an average total cost here, and here's our marginal and average variable cost curve. Remember this is the same because we have a constant heat rate for this power plant. and we have expect this plant to run at 80% capacity factor. So we have, uh, here is our uh, expected average capacity factor over the lifetime of the plant. The, the average total cost at 80% average capacity factor is our levelized cost of energy which was 2990. Right? So we can um, th these a the average total cost uh, and marginal cost curves along with the anticipated capacity factor uh, tells us a lot about the uh, long run costs of the power plant and it's also going to tell us a lot about when we should use it. Uh, relative to uh, opportunities to use other power plants.